Okay, so we're gonna be mixing a Halloween video with this for you guys. So we're gonna be looking at the Talking Angela game. So I've still, I still see some news online that there's a man in her eyes. Look at this photo right here. Kind of does look photoshopped. But when I install Talking Ginger, let me get my phone in. Let me get my phone real quick. Okay, let me show you guys what I saw in Talking Ginger. Look at that eye. Counts like a shadow almost. The more you see, the more... Here, I played the game and I saw some creepy things in there. I uncovered a man in... Ginger's eyes. Okay? When I installed it back in August, I saw it. If I install it now, I probably will still see it. But anyways, let's look at Talking Angela. I'm already creeped out. Good thing they removed the um, ability to chat, but Tom loves Angela. If you can still find it on iOS and Android, you could, she could still talk to you. I mean... Her eyes are not as open and bigger as this one. All right, let's take a look at it. Talking Angel is a scary urban legend about a mobile phone app that allows creepy hackers to interact with kids and take pictures of them. So that eye kind of does look photoshopped, but let's take a look at the post. Talking Angela started as a mobile phone application used by a lot of children, including me. Angela is a white cat with blue eyes who has a conversation with you and can't answer any questions you ask. So maybe if they still had this, I would just, if if I installed the app and they had this tough way she talks to, I would ask her, do you play Fortnite? Okay. Recently, an email began to circulate warning people not to use Talking Angela. It said the app had been taken over by a creepy guy who uses it to spy on children and possibly kidnap them. He has managed to hack into the app and uses it to gain access to personal information on people's phones. He said that it said that if you're over 18, nothing happens, but if you're younger, the cat asks, starts asking weird questions like, Where do you live? What are your parents' names? What is your phone number? Etc., etc., etc. They say the creepy man is able to take photos and record video of you through the phone's camera, and if you zoom in and look carefully at the cat's eyes, you can actually see him. Sometimes there's just an empty room, but sometimes you can see a creepy guy watching you. Even if you close down the app, it keeps running in the background, and so you can watch and take pictures of you. Let's take a look at it. Let's look. Hang on. How do I need this? Okay. So let's take a look at Angela's eyes. All right. Kind of looks like those, uh, kind of looks like a background of some sort. Let's, let me install it real quick. All right, let's do this. Talking Angela. Let's install this creepy game. Creepy, creepy game. Shouldn't take that long because I don't think this takes much gigabytes. All right, let me get off the app real quick. Oh, look, it's already, it's loading pretty fast for an app. It's almost halfway done already. And now it's over halfway done. It's taking, takes less than a minute to install now. Now we're just installing it. 
Okay, let's play this creepy, creepy game now. This game begins eight. Okay, we're gonna. I'm not gonna put in my real birth year. Okay, we're gonna try and. Uh, no, we will not. All right. So I feel like if you zoom in closer, let's go to her eyes. We're gonna zoom into the eye. You see anything? So I feel like the man in her eyes has gone away. Okay. What? This is so creepy. <laughs> Alright, what is this? What is this thing right here? Oh, I just gave her a gift. Night Nectar? Buy for 20 quid? Absolutely not. Alright, here we go. I'll buy this string. Let's see what the reaction to this string is. Did that scare you? Because that did not for me. Oh, I can buy items? What can I get? Let's look at the items. Whoa, orange necklace. 990 coins? What the heck? So expensive. Why is this stuff so expensive? What's this fortune cookie? It says, just because you don't have a prince doesn't mean you're not a princess. Wow, lame fortune. Like, I'm going to add that to my story. What's this? Oh, no. Makeup? What can I get to the makeup? Flirty makeup? What else can I get? Tiger makeup? Flirty makeup, I can totally afford that, but I'm not going to buy it. Classic. Okay, we'll go with classic. Alright. Alright, let's take a look at her. So apparently I don't see any problems with this app now. I think the urban legend has gone away. Oh, I accidentally touched some I shouldn't have. Now, if this was real life, touching her in places that you shouldn't have touched her would be considered sexual harassment. In case you didn't know, this isn't a real cat. Check it out. You can't see anything in her eyes. It seems that the man in her eyes has went away since they removed it. And what's this? Alright, that was creepy. I just made a video. Share to YouTube? Absolutely not. I'm too old for this game, so I'm not even supposed to be sharing. I'm not going to share this stuff on YouTube. But on, I will download it. I'll download it. Just... I'll download it and add, it and add it to my TikTok. Just later, we'll do it to my TikTok. Okay, let's look at some more urban legends real quick. All right. So apparently, I didn't find anything creepy in the app. All right, let's see what other people. Let's see. Let's continue the post. One more sinister case is a young girl was ta was talking to Angela and she got the scare of her life. Angela asked her age and the girl decided to lie and say she was 30 years old. She was horrified when the cats found out that's a lie. You're about 11 or 12. The girl was shocked and stunned. Then, as if I could see the expression on the girl's face, she said, I know you're about to leave me. Take care, sweetheart. In another case, the child, a child was talking to the cat and happened to place his finger over one of Angela's says, The cat said, take your all aim. Take a swear word I'm not supposed to say, hand off my eye, I can't see. The boy closed on the app, but later had a clicking sound coming from the phone as if it was taking photos of him. 
So the Spanish language website claimed that a young boy named by a young boy named Eli Morenos, who lived in the suburb of Dallas, Texas, just spent shortly after the mother downloaded the Talking Angela app. One woman claimed that her daughter stayed home from school now and was on her iPod playing with Talking Angela. Her mother overheard the conversation and said the cat knew her daughter's name and asked strange question like, Hi, where is your brother? The girl said he was right here next to me and the cat said, Oh, cool. When the cat asked, what do you do for fun? The girl played, I don't know, and Talking Angel's voice suddenly changed to some sort of weird robotic voice. It asked the little girl, when you date, when do you go, when do you go on your dates? The child was embarrassed. She got a red face and said nothing. At one point, the mother said she heard enough and yelled her daughter to shut off the app. She was so... Freaked out that she called the police department. They said they would have the inner investigations unit look into it. They called her back and announced that something is behind that cat. When the police officer came to interview the little girl, she told him that she had been using the app with her cousin. Angela asked both girls her, their names and her brother's name, and what's the school they what's the school they went to. It also took a picture of them when the girl asked the app again because they remembered that she had a brother. Apparently, the cat is all asking girls for their phone numbers and if they had their first kiss yet. Okay, good thing they removed that feature from the app, because I am freaked out. Alright guys, but anyways, that's all I hope you guys enjoyed this video. What'd you guys learn? Would you guys play this app? I didn't see anything wrong with the app. As you can see, apparently this app looks completely innocent. And if you guys enjoyed, be sure to hit the like button in the face and subscribe to my wolf pack. I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.